The Lone Star Conference has decided to punt, while the MIAA may go for it on fourth down. That's today on Midwest Sportsnet. Hi, I'm Joey McWilliams. Thanks for watching. Please do consider subscribing to this channel, Midwest Sportsnet. Well, Division Two made the announcement on Wednesday that it would be canceling all fall sports championships for 2020, right after Division Three had made that same announcement. Now, that was on Wednesday. Since that time, there's been a little bit of opportunity for leagues to consider really what this means and how to handle it. Well, some more decisions came down on Friday. Now, the Great Lakes Valley Conference in Division Two had already said about a week and a half or so ago that it was going to be pushing all of its fall intercollegiate activity into the spring semester, that with the exception of cross country. So football, volleyball, soccer, all those sports would compete in the spring semester. Cross country will still be able to compete in the fall. On Friday, the Lone Star Conference made a similar announcement. Friday afternoon, it came out that the LSC was going to be pushing its fall competition all the way into the spring, of course, with cross country being the lone holdout and, and it being a low contact sport cross country st could still be competed in the fall. But if you're a fan of fall intercollegiate activity happening, you know, in the fall, there's still a glimmer of hope, and that glimmer comes in the form of the MIAA, the Mid-America Intercollegiate Activities Association, on Friday put out a statement saying it wasn't quite ready to throw in the towel for the fall just yet. According to Commissioner Mike Racy, he said, like last winter and spring, our hearts break again for MIAA student-athletes and coaches who will not have an opportunity this fall to compete for NCAA national championships. Our student-athletes train to be the best in the country in their particular sport, and it is very difficult to accept when that pinnacle event is taken away. He continues, as an association, we are committed to exploring every option available for MIAA student-athletes and coaches to be engaged in meaningful intercollegiate athletic activities this fall. Our commitment remains that we will do this in a healthy and safe environment for MIAA students, coaches, and staff. So it looks like that there still may be a chance to have some kind of fall intercollegiate activity coming here in Division Two, and the MIAA is, has not really said yet. As a matter of fact, according to Commissioner Racy, uh, they're, they're backing off for just a moment. Their commitment remains that they will try to make something happen in the fall. Now, the NCAA, after it had made its decree on Wednesday saying that there would be no fall sports championships, also said, and this is how uh, conferences can still have activities in the fall, and put forward a list of resocialization guidelines. That list can be found at ncaa.org. If you search resocialization, you can find that list of guidelines. And it's some pretty lengthy reading. If you do and want to read that much, great. I don't know that I necessarily encourage it because it's a similar reading time to the first three volumes of the Encyclopedia Britannica. There are so many things that need to go into place according to the NCAA resocialization guidelines for activity intercollegiate competition to take place in fall of 2020 but the MIAA is saying that hey it may do just that so we will keep you posted on that here on Midwest Sports Net thanks for watching again I'm Joey McWilliams I appreciate your time please do consider subscribing to this channel God bless you and have a great day